The Simpson prophecy has lost its credibility as this 2024 prophecy has failed. While we see myriads of prophecy coming forth online, you don't want to miss this one. If you as a subscriber, stay tuned. And then I saw an attempt on his life. I saw them declaring Donald Trump as the president of America. Two four. I see plans to stop Donald Trump from Fine, that he shall pray as a man that has never prayed in the White House. Okay. Shalom family, this is your Prophet, Prophet Daniel. Remember to like, subscribe and comment on these videos. If you are a new viewer to Prophetic Rush TV, click that subscribe button family, post notification bell, like and share for the algorithm of YouTube. Now, former President Donald Trump was almost taken out and there are some prophecies I want to share today. Family about what almost took place in the life of the president, our former president. No, we have never seen a political leader, especially in America, that is prayed for so much as we have seen former president Donald Trump under the prayer watch of the church and many ministers. And it seems like God is speaking over his life also. One of the pivotal things I want to say to my viewers and subscribers is always pray for those that are in leadership for they are more likely to be under the attack of the enemy. I want to use 1 Timothy chapter 2, verse 1 to 3 as a platform to encourage the believers to pray for those that are in leadership position, whether in your church, your country, whether the nations of the world. Pray for all men and all people. 1 Timothy chapter 2, verse 1 says, I exhort therefore that first of all supplications, Prayer, prayers, intercessions, and giving of thanks be made for all men. Verse 2 says, For kings and for all that are in authority, that we may lead a quiet and peaceable life in all godliness and honesty. Verse 3 says, For this is good and acceptable in the sight of God our Savior. No. We have got to continue to pray for those that are in leadership family. I see something exceptional about Trump because he's always speaking about God, always speaking about Jesus family. There are other reservations that people might have, but God is the one that chose leaders. So let us look at these videos also and watch out for what is going to take place in America as Trump is going to be elected second term as some of these prophecies state viewers and subscribers i've never got any prophetic word about donald trump but i believe that this man believes in god listen watch this video drop a comment below tell me what you think about these words of wisdom word of knowledge or prophetic word that is given concerning america former president donald trump shalom family one love he predicted him. Trump attempt three all months ago. America, all throughout, and I saw Trump rising up, and then I saw an attempt on his life. Uh, that w the, this bullet flew by his ear, and it came so close to his head that it busted his drum eardrum. And I saw um, he was he fell to his knees during this time frame, and he started worshiping the Lord. He got radically born again during this time frame. I'm talking. People say he's saved now, but he becomes really on fire for Jesus, for what I saw coming. And um, then I saw people interceding when he, and I see him, I saw him winning the, the presidency uh, through great, uh, the Lord showed me it would go clear into the, the summer, great persecution would come on him through the judges and through the, um, through the law and all these people trying to sue him and all this stuff, but there would be a stop to it and their things would start to, to, to break free come toward the fall. And then I saw him winning uh, the election uh, through uh, the Patriots coming out and voting. And then, and then, and then there will be a great economy crash. Prophetic messages were given about Donald Trump facing crisis. It came to pass in 2023. In 2023. In the year 2024, I see plans to stop 
Donald Trump from competing, from competing from the USA general elections. If he overcomes all these trials, the crown will fit his head. If he overcome, the crown will fit his head. Will fit his head. That is the mind of God for the year 2024. Now God says, a president, that I will bring you to the White House. And they will say he is ungodly. He does not know God. But ah, ah. Even as Jesus disguised himself for the great feast, so I have disguised this man's heart. And when he comes to the White House, not only shall he be mine, but he shall pray as a man that has never prayed in the White House. Is anybody excited about this? That same man, that same man says the Spirit of God shall put his feet onto this platform. And God says, they will say, how did this take place? Laws shall change. Young men and young women shall have access into the kingdom and with authority into politics and with authority into the industries that now have been controlled by darkness because of this man that shall rule for another two terms, for two terms. God said, do not fear, for the Lord says there will be no unnecessary, unnecessary stuff, but there will be things that men shall question. Fear not, for you shall sit in that seat and suddenly my spirit shall come upon him and baptize him with a fire and with anointing says the spirit of the lord come on no more war no more war no more war no Space of three months, I saw him bringing America to a standstill. But he will not rule America with a good health. Pray for.